Hey guys, what's going on? I am going to share with you again today about creating the $3 million from Neville Goddard's special VIP meetings that he held that my grandfather went to. Okay, my grandfather um, was a VIP member at Neville Goddard's spe secret meetings in the back of the Wilshire Ebell Theater in Los Angeles. Okay, so my grandfather was attending these. But first, my grandfather went through a whole phase of trying to disprove Neville Goddard, which he couldn't do with the ladder exercise, and he ended up finding out that the law of assumption is real, just like the law of gravity. And all you have to do is imagine it in your mind, fall asleep with it, and you'll get anything that you want in your life. So this really, I mean, naturally, this is going to entice you. It's actually, it's going to get you involved. You're going to want to, I mean, anyone with a rational mind or anyone that wants to have a great life is going to be, you know, enticed by this, is going to, they're going to be wanting to learn more about the law of assumption once they have actually practiced this and they find that it works. Anyways, my grandfather, after trying to disprove Neville, couldn't do it. He ended up attending and being a, being a VIP member at Neville Goddard's special meetings. Okay, and at these special meetings, my grandfather went through a series of training exercises where my grandfather left his body. He took off, he took his skin off like it was clothing in a, in a deep meditation with special mantras. And he actually went out of his body and he said that he told me specifically that when he exited his body, took off his clothes like it was like it was clothing, he went inside of a clock that was in the room, up in the clock, and he became the clock, and then he was able to look outside into the room and realize that everything was him. And then he saw the entire city of Los Angeles and he noticed that the, the town of Los Angeles was him. He like he connected the conscious the that's when you have that that moment that exp that's what they call it in Buddhism that's what they call it um, that's what they call it when you actually can under when you get that moment of understanding what consciousness is what this illusion is well he had that in that moment and he realized that Los Angeles was him the world was him just like the dream that we go into at night when we're we're creating these different scenes in our in our dream state. And we think when we're inside of our dream, we're thinking that all these people and all these places that we're going are separate from us. We're driving cars, we're on trains, we're in planes, we're, we're in helicopters, we're traveling, we're meeting new people. We see people that we are familiar with in our dreams at night. But if you think about it, those people aren't separate, just like they're not separate in this world. That is a world that's created by your mind. This world is created in the same way, just a denser version of it. A, a more dimensions that's it but it's created the exact same way so my grandfather had that same feeling during his meetings at Neville Goddard when he went outside went in out of his body took his took his skin off like it was clothing went into the clock saw Los Angeles and he realized that Los Angeles was him the world was him it was all connected he was the dream itself so he had this he had this awakening but there was more techniques that were taught there and Neville Goddard specifically taught a technique where he taught everyone how to make $3 million within a certain amount of time. And it was creating a vivid scene of you, you got, he's Neville Goddard said, you, you find two people that you're very familiar with, either it's a family member or a friend, relative, someone, two people that you know, that you, you know their characteristics, you know their body language, you know their facial features very well, you know their, the, the, the vo their voices, you can hear their voices, you know what they smell like, you know what they look like, you, you, everything. So you can bring, a, like you create a vivid scene with these people in your imaginary clip before you go to sleep at night. So you create these, these two people that are congratulating you on your accomplishment, on your creating your three million dreams. And, the three million dollars, and they're and they're just blown away with the emotion, and it's a it's a huge emotional scene, and you're surrounded by the things or the house that you're living in, in following the money coming to you. So you create the entire scene, and you do this for a certain amount of nights, and it will come to you. And Neville Goddard taught that three million dollars can be created by visualizing a scene of two very familiar people congratulating you and coming and giving you a hug. And you and you and you focus on their face, their facial features, and the way their sound is, and you just get really, really clear what you hear, what you smell, what you see, what you feel, because you're grabbing them, you're hugging them, and you're crying in the scene. You're getting so emotional in the scene that it creates the reality. You impress that subconscious mind 
with having this amount of money because you're being congratulated and you're actually going to the future and you're making the future now activating the positron and that will ultimately bring it into your life and that's what Neville Goddard was teaching and he went into many many other techniques which I'm going to get into I just haven't had time to get into the full details because a lot of bullet points in my grandfather's notes and I want to make sure that everyone's okay with that um, in my family so I want to make sure that I bring out but I'm going to bring out some more stuff guys so just relax I hope you love the content that I am giving I'm trying to stay on point with you guys and post videos every day and teach you what I can but um, I just love doing this I feel fulfilled and um, I'm creating some really really big things in my life and I know you guys are also creating some awesome things in your life if you're watching this channel great things are going to come to you just because you're watching this channel and you're going to find out that God has his light right on you and he's going to rain down abundance right to you if you're watching this channel if you're trying to learn you're trying to develop yourself you're trying to create good things especially if you're living with love and passion in your life and gratitude and just and and being the observer of your life and changing people around you but understanding that how you look at somebody can change that person so if there's people out there that aren't doing the right things start looking at them with different eyes Look at them as if they are doing the great things in their lives, that they are great people, and it will change them. All right, guys, and I love you very much. I want to get this video out, and I will see you guys tomorrow. And give me a thumbs up, and give me something you're grateful for in the column box below.